The next frontier is underwater because we have access to a huge amount of space that is not available on land. The mission of this technology is to change agriculture, to give it an added possibility for growing produce on the huge amount of coastlines of the earth. That's thousands of kilometers of possible sites. Biospheres are kind of like big contact lenses that we anchor to the seafloor. Inside these domes, we capture air. Effectively, it's a air volume enclosed in a space anchored to the seafloor underwater. We tested hundreds of different plants, ranging from strawberries to tomatoes, beans, and of course, uh, herbs. We have the difference in the uh, light spectrum that reaches our plants. We have thermal stability thanks to the ocean water around us. We have the complete separation from outside pathogens and pests. Nothing can reach our plants underwater. And we have access to fresh water, which is naturally sourced from evaporation, which means it lets go of its salt contents and it becomes fresh water. Basically, it's raining inside the biospheres. We have sensoring systems, so uh, oxygen percentage, uh, CO2 percentage, uh, temperature of the water, temperature of the air inside, and uh, illuminance, of course, if needed. My hope for underwater farming is that it becomes a standard, meaning not answer the issue of how are we going to feed the whole world, but in the regions that need it.